Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. On the series strategy game, and we are of course returning to our Mongolia Let's Play in House of Iron for Kaiserreich Edition, where we are playing as the Mad Baron. So, Mongolia has grown a little bit, and just now the Fingosian government over here has declared war on us. So, uh, we've started our preparations over here. Um, it is early mid-February, so mm, weather isn't actually great. Also, these guys are a little bit... Um, well, they do have a decent army, I have to say that. So they are relatively well spread out, although their organization is maybe not as good as it would need to be. Um, on the other hand, I've been thinking a bit about this because we have a lot of divisions here in training. Um, and I think what I would like to do, actually, is grab a couple of these guys, um, maybe allocate you over here, and then just deploy all of these guys. There we go. So now we are training a lot more people, but we have all of these 16 divisions here. Uh, they are extremely, they have very, very bad combat modifiers. Uh, but you know what, I think that's fine. Um, let's actually try to grab um, like six of you. You're going to be assigned to you over here, and you're just going to try to come up this way and just be ready over there. Right, and then these guys over here, I think we can just try to loop you around, basically. So let's try to bring you over here into the rear of these units and you know what these guys here um, can sort of try to do the same thing you going there you going here that should be okay right and i think we do need to be a little bit slower here in during the war because our guys really are not the strongest and um, you guys over here um i suppose what you could do is well okay let's grab another army new one over here a harsh leader infantry officer politically connected you're all infantry i would like to get more cavalry guys well, apparently we don't have these, so... Let's pick... I don't know, you look fun. Right, okay. And your job is going to be to... Continue this expansion over here. And of course you are going to get an offensive line, but more or less just so that you gain some experience uh, from that. And before you do anything else, do come over here via rail. Right, that's perfectly fine. So, uh, we are training up all of these guys because we have an enormous amount of infantry equipment that we did gain uh, from our guys uh, well, when we did beat the Chinese, which wasn't that long ago, so I think that's fine. And um, by the way, I should check you guys here. You are... We could actually ch change you towards the artillery brigade here. Because we do have the manpower and we do have the towed to 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 artillery. So yeah, I think that's okay. And you want the same really for you as well. There we go. It's going to further reduce the organization, but that's fine. Um, and you know, that being said, we can get rid of all of you guys. And then start to train you up here. Let's try to get a couple of you. Right, this, I think something about like this should be okay. Fine. So we're training eight divisions here. Let's, let's try to do that. Right, let's start the game. And see what we can do. Right, so you are all moving into there, so that's good. We are a little bit reluctant to push in there. Oh, we do have decisions available. Um, yeah, we are building up a couple of things. We could do war propaganda, but since our war support is extremely high, I don't think we need to do this, so that's okay. And there we go. Fine. Fantastic. Good stuff. There we go. You're moving in there. That's good as well. Um, I suppose just one of you can stay here and try to defend this area, whereas you all guys are going sort of into their rear. Yeah. Let's try to do it this way. I would like to cut off most of their guys uh, sort of doing this that way. Right, there we go. So you're coming in down there. Um, could I maybe try to come up here? And you know what? We are going to try to attack this gentleman over here just to basically cut him off. And um, you're going to come over here and you, my friend, are going to also make this attack just so that these guys are being pinned down. And that should be perfectly fine. Um, and you know what, actually, you can support this attack because it would be very lovely indeed if we could actually break through over here and uh, ca basically catch these guys here off guard. That would be lovely, wouldn't it? Right, so you're now under attack, that's okay. Um, I suppose you can try to come on this way as well. We are doing further stuff over here. Well, this is hills only, so let's actually try to come down here. While you are attacking over there. Yeah, that's okay too. Good. Right. You are coming down there. You could try to get over here, I suppose. 
Um, and you over there. Just try to just try to be quick about this. Finish them off. Cast the die alone. There we go. So we are going sort of this uh, down this route. We are not so being supported by the Russians here. Uh, base stability. Yes, I think I would very much like to see that. So let's do this. And that is fine. Good. And um, you guys can come into here because this is not guarded anymore by them. So that is nice. And let's sort of flank them over here. Have you guys support this attack? So, ooh, there's actually a very wide combat over here. And you guys do finish up here. And you, my friend, can attack as well. You attack this, or support this attack, you support this attack. Yeah, so these guys should fall relatively quickly there. Right, let's try to get you over here. I suppose you can advance into there. So yeah, let's let's just try to keep moving. Not the uh, not the militia up there, but everything else uh, we can try to move. Right, let's try to go this way. I think that could be okay. Right, you've actually come up around there already. We might try to come towards the uh, capital already. If we can beat these guys without further ado, that'd be lovely. You're coming up there, that's good as well. Elastic defense, good to see that. Um, I do think we want to go Blitzkrieg, mostly for the um, for the damage over here, so that would be lovely. Tactics movement, yes, I think that would be great. But yeah, let's continue that research. Okay, you're not making any progress here. We do need to stop you from doing this. You guys are moving around a little though, so let's try to flank around there. We are bobbing these guys, hopefully. Come on. You can do this. And everyone else is coming up. Yeah, that's okay. Good. Um, yeah, let's do try to come down here. If you're coming up there, you might want to do that as well. And you know what? Let's simply come up here with all of these guys. Yeah, that's great. Ooh, order saving. There we go. You guys can try to attack down there already. And you are coming up there. That's good. Support this. Really need to break break through here first, but that's okay. And um, yeah, this is not going to go well either. But we might again just try to come towards the capital. Master John offers to defect. Communicating by mounted messenger, General Master John of the Fengushan government has offered to defect, citing his once close relationship with Sanguli. But his growing disfaction with the Grand Marshal's political overreach, Sun is known to be an effective, if eccentric, general, spending much of his time practicing his superb marksmanship. Likely a product of the early life he spent roaming the northeastern plain. Well, so, skill general, political power, manpower. Three millions of <laughs> You know what? I'm interested in this guy. Who are you? This is you. Guerrilla fighter, trickster. Reckless. Eh, we might as well take him. Sounds like a decent guy. Good. Um, you're going to come up over here. So we're going to try to achieve their collapse here fairly quickly. You need to stop there. This is an attack that just doesn't go anywhere. These guys are reordering themselves. That's good to see. But yeah, again, my most important objective here is the uh, town itself. Okay, you're coming up there. That's good. But yeah, let's try to grab this because it's, ah, damn it, 30, 30 victory points. 30 victory points is a lot. They have a lot of troops there, don't they? Right, okay, you're going to try to make it down there. Come on, when are you leaving? One day and five hours. Let's go over there. Oh, we've got... Japanese troops there, but uh, they are not... I was just about to say, they're not part of the war here. But apparently they are. Right, okay, let's try to get you towards the rear there. Do you want to keep them unbalanced? They are advancing up there in the north. Not the end of the world, really. Um, but not that great either. Right, you are taking into that area? Okay. Someone is breaking through up there. We have a decision available. Don't know what that is. Oh! So we have finished the first infrastructure project there. Um, I suppose I want to do this one here. Next. Oh, 
I can do all of them at the same time. So what are they doing? They costing us a couple of civilian factories. How many have we got? Oh, a couple. You know what? I do. I do think we want to take these decisions here as quickly as possible, simply so that we are building up our infrastructure. Infrastructure is hugely important. Guys, oh, try to capture this. I do hope that they'll give up. Come on. Uh, will you? No. Okay, apparently the war's not yet done. Oh, not even close. 65%. So what victory points do they have? 10? What's this? Ah. Not that much. Okay. Well, I suppose we do need to capture a couple more. That's alright. Ooh, we do have three military factories. Um, let's do try to produce more infantry equipment, because that, I think, is the item that we are short on. I have a couple of free dockyards, so I want irritatingly. Uh, that's okay. Okay, apparently I can take these decisions, even though I don't have the civilian factories, but that's okay. Okay, you've done this, that's okay. Let's try to flank around there. Mm, these mountains are not actually that great for us. So that's what I could try to do, then, is to come over here. Cut these guys off. Ah, well, it didn't quite work. Right, this way sh it should, though. That's okay. You're doing this down there. You're pushing into there. It's a little bit of a mess, but it's a beautiful mess. Um, you can actually be part of this front line there. I think that's okay. Yeah, good. This defense here, I suppose, will work out all right for us. So that should be okay. All right, let's do try to advance into there. Yeah, we are being beaten back over here. So uh, let's not do something silly there. I think that's okay, all right. We do need to come into here. Yeah, well. Would have been great to cut these guys off, but apparently that's not to be. We are winning down here, though, so that's great to see as well. Yeah, and we're just, I think, generally pushing them back. Just how many guys have they got? Yeah, I think this is the first time we're in a war where we actually have more men than the other guys. Uh, and I do think we have somewhat superior mobility here, so that is good to see. Well, you're moving into there, and um, let's try to come up here with you. They are pushing up there. They are now a little bit more concentrated down here. Which is a pity, but... Let's just try to break through over here, even though the weather is extremely bad for us. Can I do anything? Staff office plan or something? Yeah, I suppose that's possible. We do have a lot of command power. Even though the, our guys are not, mo are mostly, for the most part, uh, not truly waiting anywhere for a long time. Yeah, but you can see their uh, experience is growing very nicely, so that's nice to see. And we do have the mobility to just strike down there. Kiev. Um, so, it, it looks like down in Europe, where the second Belkrieg is brewing. Um, yeah, Belgium. So, France is losing a little bit of territory, but the Soviets are pushing into Europe. And that is not good news for us, because we are... Not immediately friendly towards the Russians, so to say. And um, you guys are, well, spending your front line. I don't want to micromanage everything there. But I do want to create a breakthrough somewhere. Let's try to come down here, through this way. Uh, I think you might come under attack there. No, you, well, you're attacking here. It would be great to, to attack into there. Well, hmm. Right, okay, over here, let's try to come up a little bit into their rear there. That should be nice. Okay, you are taking into the mountains. That's not maybe the best idea that you could have. So let's try to do it slightly differently here. Attack on the flank there. Yeah, well, now they've reinforced over there. Post, that's okay. We do have all of these rivers, but they're mostly frozen deep, so... Not much of a deal. Not 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 much of a bad thing there. Right. Okay, you eh, you need to regain some organization. Yeah, these attacks into these mountains, I'm not sure. I didn't really like those. I think this is potentially one of our bloodier wars. Yeah, twenty nine thousand people killed already. Um against sixty five thousand. That's a very bad ratio for our uh, standards. 
Right, so I think you've been you've beaten back all these guys, so they shouldn't be too too high in terms of organization. So yeah, let's try to come back behind there. Again, just trying to expand their front line, making it a little bit more difficult for them to really identify what's going on. Let's at least try to grab that province if the AI is so keen on that. Yeah, and again, just try to come up behind the area. Keep them up and mobile. Nice. Good stuff over there. And can I maybe attack into this direction? Let's stop over here. Let's grab you. Get in that direction. You're fine over here. There. Let's try to be a little bit more proactive in this in this front line so that we can cut these guys off. Okay, you're fine down there. Uh, let's try to bring you here. We are being attacked over there, but that's not too bad. Ah. Okay, we were beaten back there. Well, in that case, this is a little bit pointless now. Okay, fine. Okay, I think we need to stop these advances for a second here. Just try to consolidate a bit, just trying to make sure that we're only picking sensible fights. Like, for example, not these. Right, and up here, this doesn't seem worthwhile either. Let's wait until this guy goes away, and we can see. Right, okay. Regain some organization, get some bonuses from staff officers planning. I think most of you should be having that anyway. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, let's try to build that up. There we go. You guys can now try to get over there. And then one of you goes there, and one of you goes here. And just maybe that is gonna disrupt them enough. Okay, you can't do that. At least not for now. This guy is gonna move out at some point. So yeah, fantastic, good stuff there. Right, um, let's try to get you over here. Is this a mountain province? It is, so yeah, I think that would be a very, very good defense for us. If that was to work out. This is plains here, right? Yes, it is. Uh, but it's behind a river. That probably does mean it's a little bit more difficult. But let's try anyway. Maybe we can break through here. Good, of course, that defense will need to hold. Mm, you're making your way up here, so let's sort of leapfrog it. You make your way there, 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 there. That does mean you can come up there as well. Yep. Forgot you. Great. Alright. Looks fine over there, so we are breaking through there, I think. Nice, nice, because now we can flank around there. Well if we if we hold out on this defense as well, but I think we should very easily in fact win over there. Come on. Come on. 94, 95, 97, 99. Good. All of you, except for the weakest one, attack into here. It is Mountain Province, but just maybe they are weak enough that we can break through that. Oh, are they weak in terms of... No, it's just organization, not numbers. Right, so if we can break through over here, that would be great, because that would sort of um, kill all of these guys. Promote Mongol identity, that is done. Nice. Um, we don't really need to claim this, but I do think that an next research slot is one of our most important things. 100% bonus for land doctrine wouldn't be bad either. Research bonus for industry would be nice. Don't need more population right now. Weapons research. Don't think that is something we need right now. No. Let's attract the uh, Chinese Mongols. We don't really need the manpower, but it does open up nice other things as well. Good. Um, you guys, you... You know what? I'll stay here and support this attack here. And that should help. Hopefully defeat them a little bit faster there. They are sending in reinforcements. Where are they coming from? I think that should be it in terms of reinforcements, though. For that particular front. Yeah, no one else is going into that province. You are now. So let's make sure that we are preventing that. Okay, you should fall out of this fight as well soon. 
Come on. There we go. That does leave three divisions over there. They are very, very effective, though, because they are in the mountains. So let's try to bring in more forces. Let's try to make sure that we ourselves are not being cut off over there. Because that wouldn't be great either. Situation in the north is a little... Ooh. You know what? They're actually close to our government. Um, so, yeah, that'd be great, great, great gaming over there. Okay, let's get seven divisions over here. Um, your job is going to be to be over here. There you go. And your offensive plan is to be so on. Go, go that way. Broadly. Yeah, you're, you're evacuating yourselves there. That's okay. Don't want to withdraw anyone down here for the moment because it seems like we're doing fine. Okay, yeah, we do have more forces over there now. Well, they are sending in further reinforcements, so it just doesn't seem like we'll be able to do this. So, you know what? Let's cancel that. Let's instead try to come down here, because that, likewise, would enable us to defeat them there. And we're going to immediately relaunch that attack, because it doesn't mean we can pin them down. But over here, it just seems like a little bit more likely that we could make it over there. We do have some very low supply situations um, in some of these areas. Don't know exactly where, we'll see. Right, now we need to win over here. Ooh, and we do need to win over here, because otherwise all of these guys will be in extremely low supply effect. Right, okay. Um, let's make sure that we're coming up this way. This here needs to happen. So yeah, let's send more forces there. Come on, 71%. 72, 78. That should go a little bit faster there. Do need to hold out over here as well, otherwise their encirclement is not going to be complete. 82% and there's only two divisions. One of them is a militia, which is going to die soon. There we go, and that should allow us to win extremely quickly now. You're reinforcing this, that's fantastic. We are coming on an attack over there again. That is alright, if we can make it, and we are. Great. Perfect. Nice. Um, I think we can cancel this attack over here. And, in fact, I think what we could do is... Just do a little bit of housekeeping. Grab all of all of you guys here. Uh, you're all part of this front line now. Your job is simply going to be to do this. Let's get rid of this and that. That should be okay. You guys, you're all part of this. Defeat that. Uh, three divisions, that might be a little bit too little. But yeah, I think it's going to be alright. Good. Yeah, there we go. And we are sending forces here now, which mostly I think we'll be able to overrun them because they are fairly light over there overall. So that's okay. Right, then I suppose I do need to grab a couple of you guys, just maybe all of you, and assign you towards this over here. And yeah. So that's mountains, mountains, mountains. These are more or less all mountains. Let's wait a little while over here for these guys to to be able to where are you going? Uh, for these guys to be able to to well basically get out of supply. Okay, we are defending over here, that's okay. We are definitely defending over there. Let's try to advance into their rear over here. Okay, you are defending over there, that's nice. You're now defending there. Okay, let's grab one of you guys. Come up behind this gentleman. You, my friend, are going to come up into their rear over there. Nice. Good. Right. Over here, how are things looking? Okay, you are evacuating this mountain province, actually. Uh, which I very, very much appreciate. And you've evacuated this province here as well. That's nice. Come on, guys. Move out of there. Five days. It's too long. Right, okay. Um. Well, in that case... It's always a little bit annoying when the game does that. Okay. You. You. Okay. Fine. Good. All of you guys. Let's define this a little bit differently. Just basically take all of these. And then your job is going to be to come up down there. Fine. Nice and easy. Are you moving out now? Five days, still. It's going to take a little while. Yeah. 
all of the other stuff there is still defending, so that's good. Okay, so they are coming into our rear there now. You know what? Look, let's actually grab you and you and just get them away from our capital. Don't really like to see that. Right, up over here. Everything is fine. I do need to unpause though. Right, and the Red Army is also spreading out a little. Do advantage into empty terrain if you can. That would be fantastic. Good. Two days. So very soon I think we we'll can come into here and potentially even into there. Nice. Come on. Come on. Once they are all in one province, I think we will, of course, attack. There we go. Oh, let's go. Let's try it. There we go. 75%. They are encircled. They are out of supply. So, yeah, there we go. Fantastic. How many guys are there? Seven divisions. I think that should pretty much seal uh, their fate. They do have... Well, well, they do have a substantial amount of divisions, actually. And a lot of them are over here now, which is not that great to see. Um, let's try to make sure we are doing stuff over here as well. Okay, let's try to bring you into the front a little bit. You as well. Okay, you are attacking our flank there. Let's try to move into this province. That should be okay. Right. And these guys are soon done. Yeah, there we go. That does mean all of you guys are probably going to go all the way over there. Yeah, you are. Let's try to get you there a little bit faster. Good. Um, how are you guys doing? You, I think, all mostly prepared. Let's try to do an attack over here, just on a broad front, and try to overrun them. I think the AI does have that. Um, you guys, out of supply? Mm, not quite, but soon. Let's try to blob them there. Yeah, and that should seal their fate. Yeah, there we go. And then up back there. We're gonna go there and you there. Fine. Nice. Good stuff over there as well. While we are sort of breaking through on a relatively broad front over here. Which is also extremely nice to see. Right. Yeah, I think we're making good progress. Very nice. Good. Yeah, so overall, not quite the war that we've seen with the uh, Chinese. But on the other hand, uh, we are making progress. Um, and I think they are not that far away from surrendering. 70%. We do definitely need to make sure to get Harbin. That's another 10 victory points. Three victory points there. Another one over there. One over there. Yeah, I think really Harbin is, is the most important prize. Uh, that we can look for. So that would be great to grab. Are we looking in terms of research, industry, armaments be ahead? Um, yeah, I think that's fine. Infantry equipment, mm, we might start to research this stuff. It is 1942. Uh, it is 1940 and it's only 1939, but you know what? I think it's going to be okay. And what I would really also like to see is research, uh, recon companies. Um, we are starting to produce, I think, a little bit in terms of support equipment. So it would be very nice to grab that, actually. Yeah, let's do it a little bit like this. Yeah. Good. I think that's fine. We are missing a little bit in terms of infantry equipment, but I think we are going to be alright. Let's limit this here to, to, I think, three. And that should be okay. Good. Fantastic. So, good stuff. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and I hope to see you around next time. Bye-bye.